It's teaching all of us about the unusual ways a bill can become a law, stuff kids never learned on Schoolhouse Rock. Right now, watch this. You sure got to climb a lot of steps to get to this Capitol building here in Washington. Well, I wonder who that sad little scrap of paper is. I'm just a bill. Yes, I'm only a bill. And I'm sitting here on Capitol uh, We want to explain exactly what the House Democrats may, repeat, may do to get this legislation passed in the coming days as simply as we possibly can. Our national political correspondent, Jessica Yellen, is here with this, uh, Jessica. Uh, Schoolhouse Rock. Even some members are, are talking about this today. They are. Everybody loves Schoolhouse Rock. Wasn't that the best? Okay, we're trying to put this in Schoolhouse Rock terms, Wolf. So, first, we have the Senate version of the health care bill. He's just a law. He's just a bill trying to become a law. Uh, now, this is still awaiting action by the House. Democrats, some of them in the House, really don't like what's in that Senate version of the bill, and they're worried that if they vote for it, they will pay a big price on Election Day. So Democrats in both the House and Senate are drafting a series of changes or fixes to the bill under the suddenly famous process now called reconciliation. And those are the fixes. And in the House, leaders are considering a sort of two-for-one deal to get it all done. That two-for-one deal is called a self-executing rule. It would just deem the Senate bill passed once the fixes are approved by the House.